So Alibaba has launched a new AI called Queen, uh, which is more powerful than DeepSeek and ChatGPT. So there was so much hype going on around a uh, Chinese AI called DeepSeek. So this tool called Queen has outperformed both ChatGPT and DeepSeek in benchmark like uh, Arena Hard, uh, LiveBench, and LiveCodeBench. So in this video, I'm going to show you how you can use the Queen AI. And so to get started, you can just simply type chat dot dot ai and you can simply click enter so so you can just simply sign in with your uh, google account and this will take you to this interface and here you can see different options uh, artifact web source image generation and video generation so video generation is something uh, which is very new and comparing with deep six so image generation and video generation are the plus point here in this uh, coin lm so let's test one by one so you can see this uh, feature called artifact. So what this artifact will do is this will enable you to run and test the HTML code. So you can just simply uh, click on artifact. So let's test by putting some prompt. So let me just type something like create a portfolio. So let's type portfolio website for software developer using HTML, CSS and JavaScript and let's click enter so you can see it has already opened this artifacts here and the code is loading and so this is pretty fast as well so you can see so this has created a beautiful looking uh, portfolio website so i think it has done a pretty well job but like uh, the same thing can be done with the chat gpt and DeepSeek as well so i don't think there's much difference so let's try to go with this web search and I'm just noticing this like you can directly switch between these two. So you just have to create a new chat to use the web search. So let's go with the web search as well. So you can see this uh, recommendation as well. So I won't be going with these things. So let's try something like uh, what's the NVIDIA, uh, NVIDIA's stock price over the last five days. So let's see how it sources. So, oh, so this has given the overall decrease percentage only. So I just want the whole price list. Uh, so let me just say, I want the price list of five days. Let's see what it does. So yeah, so it has given with the references. So you can see these references from NVIDIA itself. And so it has taken the references from gold price so this has done pretty good job and you know you can see the recommendation as well can you provide the forecast for nvidia's stock price so let's see how it how it works so you can see this is giving the short term for, forecast so i think with on the basis of the different resources so it has given this forecast so this is pretty good so let's go with the image generation so let's click on new chat and click on image generation so it has shown some of the uh, examples here and you can also choose between the aspect ratio so i will go with the four by three aspect ratio and let's create a image let's type something like uh, software uh, engineer worried thinking ai will still his job and let's see how fast it will create so this is taking some time uh, i think it has done a good job so you know like i was expecting more worried uh, face so let's say I want more worried face. So let's see how it does. Oh, this has just generated a, a worried face only. Yeah, I think uh, let's try with this prompt again. And so let's say with more worried face and let's see how it works. Hmm. Now this has done a good job. So now let's go with the video generation. So let's click on new chat again and click on video generation. So you can see some examples here. And so let's go with the 16 by 9 aspect ratio. And let's type a very simple prompt, something like software engineer crying and click enter. One eternity later. So this has taken me a very long time, like one to two minutes, I guess. So there's some issue with the video generation or maybe you know this is taking much longer time than expected but like it's fine so this has generated a very really good video uh so yeah so this is how it looks uh the queen lm uh, the first look 
So I like this tool uh, very much and let's see uh, how it goes in future. So since this is a open source, so I think a lot of changes will be coming soon and I'm more hopeful for the other AI tools in future as well. So if you want to get updated with a new tools and technologies that are coming up, so just be sure to subscribe. I will see you on the next one.